Are you gonna do it? Let me video you. All you want. I'm not scared. I'm not gonna ask any questions. Look at this. These guys are living the life. Living the beach life right here. Pretty crazy, isn't it? Yeah. Beautiful, dense, bright red piece of tuna. And you line it up pretty much parallel with, uh, with the way that you're standing. Hey guys, today's video is sponsored by Skillshare. So Skillshare is an online learning community with thousands of inspiring classes. So Skillshare is always 100% ad free. Um, there's never gonna be any pop-ups or anything like that. And there's new classes added every week. I'm sitting here at our little beach house in the Bahamas waiting on everyone to wake up, having a little cup of coffee. And I've been sitting here going through this class. Let me show you. Simplifying raw fish, ceviche, crudo, and sashimi by Chef Ken Oranger. I'm not sure. But Emily and DJ absolutely love sushi. Emily's been wanting to try more sashimi. And, you know, we're in the Bahamas, home of the conch salad fresh conch like an underwater sea snail and uh, i just don't know much about that stuff so skillshare is a great place that i can go while i'm sitting here enjoying my coffee at our little beach house and learn and with your cutting board all and about it's very easy and you're cutting it whatever it is i'm wanting to learn about which today is, is go down and, and sashimi uh, and cut so you should it's a great way to sit out here have a little alone time spend some time on skillshare learning a new Learning something new. I've learned so many cool things on Skillshare when it comes to, you know, editing videos and how to shoot better video. There's a ton of courses on just like travel vlogging, which is kind of what we're doing right now. So the first 1,000 people to use the link in the description box or go to Skillshare.com and use the code ARMSFAMILYHOMESTEAD are going to get a free one month trial of Skillshare. Now let's hit the water. Here comes cappuccino. So this is mocha, cappuccino, and the big one oh, is she took the stick. <laughs> All right, I just found, we just found the dream world, see? <laughs> I like the farm life. I like the animals. DJ likes the beach life. Watch out, is this our compromise? We just compromised <laughs> and found an island full of farm animals. We did. Yeah, yes. <laughs> <laughs> the Bahamas is the perfect place for us. It is. <laughs> So, a lot of people from the United States come to the Bahamas to swim with the pigs, to see the swimming pigs. Famous swimming pigs. But these are not the ones you see on Instagram and TikTok and these are these are a little different. This is not the big touristy island, right? Nope. This is a private island up here in Spanish Wells where you don't have to fight in big crowds to see swimming pigs. Yeah, there is uh, not another human in sight. He just knows the song. Look at those shout on that pig. Oh, hey, why are you pointing sticks? Sorry, as big as very large. Oh! Step on your toe. <laughs> So I hear your your pigs prefer chicken hot dogs over pork they hot dogs. They definitely do. <laughs> they we don't do the pork, only chicken. All bar s. See, that that's my favorite brand of hot dog. And my wife's like, oh, bar s. Those are the cheap ones. I said that's the best hot dog. The out best there. dogs. Pig approved. You hear that, DJ? Mm -hmm. He knows what's up. He buys bar s hot dogs. <laughs> I don't like bar s. <laughs> that's what the pigs prefer. I don't have any. I do. Look at all the bunny rabbit feeding. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> <clears throat> For any of you that watch uh, I'm a Survivor Sanctuary, um, I'm pretty sure Lester lost his turkey because uh, 
back. <clears throat> it must have migrated uh, out <laughs> to the Bahamas. Here, turn this way. He's <laughs> filling his sack back up now. Well, there. Yep. Yep. I, I got Jason on FaceTime from Cog Hill Farm. We've got, we were just talking, we got internet in the Bahamas on a remote island with a turkey what? and some pigs. Oh. Tried to call Lester There's to show him Cornholio out here on the beach, but he didn't answer. It's crazy because uh, I can talk to I can talk to Jason on FaceTime out here in the middle of nowhere. But uh, can't even have a phone call at my house hardly. <laughs> All right, Jason, man. All right, buddy. I'll holler at you later. Y'all have fun. See ya. What's up? Cornholio, what's up, bud? It's Cornholio. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> These guys are living the life. Living the beach life right here. Pretty crazy, isn't it? Yeah. Man. These guys are living a lot better life than Pepper. <laughs> yeah. okay. Pepper has to sit around and put up with donkeys and, you know, <laughs> all the rest of our crazy Pepper animals. She said Pepper ran her over this morning. Katie, Daniel's video and don't say anything inappropriate. She wouldn't do that. I'm pooping. Oh, she's pooping. That's like the theme of the video today. <laughs> okay. That guy looks just like old Cornholio on I'm a Survivor Sanctuary. I think this guy may live a little bit more life of luxury on a tropical island. So basically, like he said, they, they bring food and water to these animals every day. And people come on their charter tours and can come hang out with the swimming pigs and the turkey and the rabbits. And basically, an animal sanctuary on a tropical island. So, you enjoy the good life, buddy? Much better than living in the no turkey ordinance city that you came from? Yeah? Spit and drum and strut if you like it here. Yeah? Aqua Bliss Charters. We'll leave links in the description box. Um, call Gino, check him out on Instagram. This, this is cool. And trust me, they're not like two pigs or one leg. I like the gimpy duck <laughs> and a one leg, <laughs> a one leg seagull. Just out here living the rescue life, huh? So this is Gino from Aqua Bliss Charters. If someone wants to come out here and bring their family to do this kind of stuff like what all besides this first off do you offer and second how can they get a hold of you well we offer a lot i mean we do <laughs> deep sea fishing we do reef fishing we do spear fishing we do feeding sea turtles snorkeling we have beautiful sandbars and swings in the middle of nowhere we have the swimming pigs and pretty much if you can think it up we can make it happen and if you want to get in touch with us you can find us on the internet at aquablisscharters.com. You can find us on Instagram at aquablisscharters and also on Facebook at aquablisscharters. And it's legit. This, this is so cool. We spent a couple days on the island and getting to go around and, and hit some beaches and stuff, but actually being able to get out on a boat with someone like Gino that's a local that knows pretty much everything. I mean, he did grow up here knows everything about all these islands it's so cool to get to learn some history it's so cool to get to see all the little off the wall tourist attractions i mean like we don't do chain stuff right like we didn't come the reason we came to the bahamas and didn't go see uh atlantis atlantis is we didn't because go to nassau and go there that's where you most people go it's a tourist to the, trap to bit the big resort yeah we yeah. didn't want that that's right so we went like jet jet taxi <laughs> boat golf cart just to get to our house yes it's super cool though it's fun it's fun it's awesome yeah this is so cool so much more than what i expected i promise you we appreciate it glad you guys are enjoying
We're doing some conch hunting. Conch so we're gonna go out and gather some fresh conch and Captain Gino's gonna make us some conch salad right here on the boat and uh, maybe do a little fishing. I don't know what all we're gonna get into, but it's gonna be fun, I can promise you, because uh, guess what? We're in the Bahamas. Yep. It's a cool look you got there. Is it? So the whole trip, mom's been asking for fresh ceviche. C ceviche. Which yeah. ceviche is usually fish. Yeah. Conk salad is basically the same thing with a snail instead of a fish. I'll try it. A sea snail. <laughs> yeah. Hey, also, uh, I think we should sell these. I love these. <laughs> it's like well, my new favorite thing. I found it for Ross the other day. Uh, we're not sponsored by Columbia, unfortunately, but I do like these hats. The big white, just like this. Yes. We're not at the creek anymore. I know. <laughs> so right now, Captain Gino's out in the water and uh, we're trying to find a good spot that the kids will be able to dive down and get some conch too. So we're in about 10 feet of water right now, but he's just trying to find a place where there's quite a few conch. And uh, he left me in charge. It's a little scary. He said, I'll leave Daniel in charge. Actually, he just said, drive the boat and go that way. That's about it. The water is insane. It is pretty, isn't it? Oh my gosh. How was that, bud? Got a How are you doing? <laughs> Well, there's three conch in the boat, and uh, we're gonna troll around see if we can find a few more. We got a little storm kind of blowing by us real quick, but hopefully it passes pretty quickly. I think it went to time lapse on its own. This is a helmet conch. It's a lot different. We don't eat this kind. It's just to be pretty. Cool. Yeah, it's a lot different type of conch. So we're going to put this guy back and he'll grow up to be a big, beautiful helmet comp. Nice. There's another one over there. That one's no good. Oh. Ready? Tide's going, so you, you ready? You got to keep swimming this way. One, two, three. Job. That's four. Yeah, the defeat team on this side, the frozen lava ball. This side, we have the defeat team oh. that hugs you. <laughs> so pretty on this side. On this side. Yeah, it's so pretty. Look how big It is. 
So we went and got, well actually we, no. I went and got Kong for everybody. Your sister got one. I got yeah, one. I know. And now we're gonna have some ceviche. So it's the catch, clean, and eat, not a catch, clean, and cook, huh? Exactly. Right here on the beach, our little storm blew over. DJ didn't get rained on. Everybody's happy now. That's how we get conk out. And inside, there's a little muscle that attaches to the shell. We're just trying to release that muscle to get the conk out of the shell. Just like that, Mom. Wow, out comes the conk, Whoa. and that's completely clean and ready to carry home. That's cool. I don't know if we All right, bud. That in your bag. All right, bud. You ready? Oh no, I'm not eating that. What the heck? Why not? They're gone. What is that? It's called the pistol. What? I'm not eating. Houston, you came all the way to the Bahamas, and the one thing you wanted was conch. Pretty close. Hey, do it for the channel, man. Do it for the viewers. I'm not getting that pistol thing. Why not? I'm not doing that thing. <gasps> Don't you? Come on, dude. That's what you came for. Yeah. I didn't one come for that you. piece. No. I didn't even taste it. Hey, you told him you'd eat it. Not that, mommy. You look at you backing up. I'm not eating it. I didn't think Come on, hey. That. Listen, hey, what would Donovan say if he was here? Oh. Donovan would be like, he'd be like, come on, Houston, you're a man. Come on, grow up. Don't be a titty baby. Yeah, that's what Donovan would say. <laughs> right? Do it for Donovan. He'd appreciate it. Your brother's going to. No, he ain't. <laughs> He's definitely not. No. I'm not doing it. He's the boy that wears pearls, though. Are you, yeah. Are you going to do it? Let me video you. All you want. I'm not scared. I'm not going to ask any questions. Does it taste like anything? Nope. There's really no reason to eat it. <laughs> so when you're in the Bahamas, you got to do the Bahamian thing. It's the conch pistol. Good stuff. I'm not real sure why. Oh. He's not chewing it. Look at this. It looks like a squirrel. Tastes like salt. Yeah. No real taste. Okay, then I want it. Everybody's scared to death. It's it's sitting right about here, by the oh, way. Oh, I'm going to death. I'm kidding. It, it, it's kind of. I'm kind of kidding. Come on, Emily. Show your brothers up. They're wusses. Oh, oh, hey. Here. I'm a little jelly. I'll do it if it's small. <laughs> Not even a big jelly. Just do it. Yeah, that one is tiny. Dad's was huge. Oh, Not huge. No. That I you just, hey, just, put oh, it in your mouth. There's eyes? Suck and swallow. On the con kids, there's eyes. Houston just said the eyes. What? Okay, go. Do it. I said that's gross. Okay. One. I'm doing a small piece first. One. No, you just do it all. Oh, there, no, yeah. there's. you don't break it apart. Just eat it. Just eat it. One, two, three. I hate He's it. not going to do it. Give it to me. Please. Give it to his Give sister. Oh. She'll eat it. Oh, I need like water with me. No, you don't. On hand. No, you don't. Down the hatch. Down the hatch. It's like it's like a you jumped off a 35 foot cliff earlier. Yeah, and I about fell and I about cried. Okay, <laughs> this is much easier. Come on. <laughs> oh, <laughs> <laughs> no. You can swallow it. Come on. Oh my gosh. Just down the hatch. Swallow. Stop playing with your food. I can't. <laughs> <laughs> it's like a noodle. <laughs> It's a wet noodle. What does it taste like, Emma? Uh, <laughs> I can't. <laughs> she tried. She gets scared. It doesn't time. go down. She definitely tried. It doesn't go down. Professional at cutting up stuff. You think so? Yeah. Watch out. <laughs> it's a dork fish. Scoop of Steve. Look, you found him a corn dog. <laughs> Oh, that's cute. We'll see. We've already been through this once. People on our channel don't know what a dork fish is. Yeah. <laughs> they don't know who Bill Ingvall is, apparently. Yeah. I'm a dork fish. They, sh they should know scuba steam. Oh, 
That was the Jack Sparrow run. <laughs> What all do you put in your conch salad? Putting in some nice red tomatoes, some bell peppers, onion, conch, orange, key lime, salt, and a little pepper. In the in the conch is uh, raw, so it cooks in the orange and yes, the sir. citrus juice, right? The citrus juice marinates and cooks that conch. Are you ready for it? I am. Do you have to scream when you do it? Yeah. Here's a fish. He's right there. Yeah, that shad? Go get it. Son. You're lightning fast. You might Let's catch go, it. Steve. Show us what you got. Got him in your teeth, right? Yeah. Good job, Mom. You're going to eat this, right? I don't know. You're definitely trying it. The conch, man. Lunch is prepared. Your conch salad's ready, sir. Here you go, guys. So how much do I owe you? That's what you do. Nothing. It's on the house. I'm good. I'm you good. sure? I'm good. Come on, boy. Too many vegetables. Mm, that's amazing. I don't know. I just don't like vegetables. I told him we need some tortilla chips. Yeah. I got some Pringles. There you go. Yeah. What's that? Hey, what's that dude in Louisiana? The stale cracker. Have you ever watched stale cracker videos? The Cajun dude, DJ. What? Have you ever watched those stale cracker videos? He's the Cajun cooker. He kind of looks like a. Oh, with the outdoor boys, the guy who does the outdoor. No. No. He said, "Put it on a cracker, dude." Mm -hmm. Does all that Cajun cooking? Yeah, I know what you're talking about. It'd probably be pretty good on a saltine cracker. All right, Wes, come on. You're funny. I'm good. I just had a sandwich. How is it, Em? I don't know. I don't like onions. <laughs> How's the conch? Good. It's good. I think. All I taste is onion. <laughs> All you taste is onion? <laughs> Mom really is going to put it on a Pringle, huh? Yeah. Give me a Pringle. Huh? Fish? Fish there. Well, man, it would definitely be better with tortilla chips or like pita chips or something. Can I have but a, it's so good. a chip? Yeah. Put it on a cracker, dude. Let me spare him. Gotta take the onions out once. Look at that fish right there. I ain't got time for that, Emily. Just put it on a cracker and eat it. Put it on a Pringle and eat oh, it. Yeah, it's a trigger. Put it on a Pringle, dude. Something better without the Pringle. Really? Yeah. Well, that's what are y'all fishing for back there? Sure. Anybody want mine? <laughs> fresh conch salad on the beach with fresh conch. What do I have to do? Mmm. It's so good. Mm -hmm. That's what mom would say, right? Yep. It's so good. So good. So we're not the only ones eating fresh on the beach today. Weston brought some fresh food too. He brought his girlfriend with him. Her name's Debbie. Mm -hmm. Some pecan spin wheels, huh? Mm -hmm. Old Debbie. She's a pretty girl for you, huh? Yes, she is. You're my type. <laughs> <laughs> not really. All right. Well, that's how you, or well, that's how Captain Gino makes conch salad on the beach with fresh conch that Houston dove down and caught all by himself. Well, Emily got one. She got one. You got four, right? True. Is that how many we had? Five conk? Five yeah. conk. Guys, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. And as always, we'll see you on the next video. Peace.